Henry Clay was a towering figure in American politics during the first half of the 19th century. Born in Virginia in 1777, he went on to become a prominent lawyer, a skilled orator, and a statesman of great influence. Over the course of his long career, Clay served in the United States Senate, the House of Representatives, and as Secretary of State under President John Quincy Adams. One of Clay's greatest legacies was his role in shaping the United States' economic policy. He was a strong advocate for the American system, a set of policies that aimed to promote economic growth and national unity through high tariffs, internal improvements, and a national bank. Although his vision faced opposition from some quarters, Clay's efforts helped to spur the growth of American industry and strengthen the country's economy. But Clay was more than just an economic policy wonk. He was also a fierce defender of American democracy, a vocal opponent of slavery, and a champion of the Union. In the decades leading up to the Civil War, Clay worked tirelessly to preserve the fragile peace between the North and the South. Although his efforts ultimately proved unsuccessful, his commitment to national unity and his belief in the power of compromise have left a lasting mark on American politics. In short, Henry Clay was a complex and multifaceted figure, whose impact on American history cannot be overstated. His legacy as a statesman and orator, and a defender of democracy lives on to this day.